Welcome to Game Over, brought to you by McDonald's, where the Flames dropped a 5-2 decision to the uh, visiting Detroit Red Wings here on Thursday night. The Flames uh, opening up a three-game homestand. Not the way they wanted to. They allowed a couple of power play goals uh, and just uh, weren't very good defensively. No, it's ultimately what it came down to. There were some defensive miscues tonight. Uh, a couple of beauty power play goals by the Detroit Red Wings. Nothing that Dan Vladar could do on a couple of those. And just overall, it was a little unorganized out there for the Calgary Flames. They had a team coming in off of back-to-back. -back. They didn't, didn't take advantage of it tonight and uh, find themselves kind of going to have to focus on the next one. Mm -hmm. Not a lot of positives to take out of this one. One, though, we did find with this is an easy one. Dylan Dubé uh, continuing his point streak. He now has four goals in three games. He's the hot hand for the team right now. Yeah, and seven points over that stretch. And he's been in all the right spots. And we talk about the Calgary Flames needing to get more people in the interior and some of these chances from in tight, taking away the goalie's eyes, putting pucks on net, and again, just skating all over the ice. Tonight, Dylan Dubé used his speed, snuck away, and that was the beauty he scored here yep. at the Saddle Dome. Just a beautiful shot there going glove side. So uh, what can you do if you're the Flames? I think forget about this one and try to move on. Of course, the highly anticipated rematch with the New York Rangers coming up on Saturday. Goaltending has been a hot topic all season. Uh, what do you think about the goaltending situation this Saturday? And, and how did the Flames turn this one around for Saturday? Well, it's going to be, again, like you said, Dasha, flush it, forget about it. Um, they'll maybe look at a few of the plays that didn't go right tonight, and then you just get amped up in practice to get ready to go, and then we look at the opponent that's coming in here. Uh, they haven't gotten any worse by picking up Vladimir Tarasenko. Mm -hmm. uh, they're a star-studded lineup, and they're a high-powered offense, so the Flames have no reason not to be up for this game. Okay. We are looking forward to it. Uh, thank you for joining us. We will see you back here on Saturday. Uh, game time between the Flames and Rangers is 8 p.m. Saturday night.